Hi guys, we have seen the concept of class and object in our last video. Now how to create a class and object in Java? It's simple. First the keyword class, then class name and that's it. We can create variables and methods inside class. We need to use the new keyword to create an object. For example, I am creating a class employee with an integer id and a string name. Let's create an object of this class inside main method. So public static void main and employee emp equals new employee. So this is a syntax or way of creating an object. First class name that is employee, then the object name that is emp and on rhs we need to use new keyword and again class name with round braces. The round braces are actually for a constructor which we'll see in our upcoming videos. Here I am initializing the variable directly by using object that is imp.id equals thousand and imp.name equals deeper and then calling the display function. Let's see some formal stuff. We call it as reference variable and this is employee object. I know that you are confused so let's see how it looks in memory. So AMP is a reference variable that, that is it points to a memory block. So EMP.ID equals thousand. Then EMP.name equals deeper and at the end the function display is called. Let's revise everything. Here I created a class employee with a string and an integer id. Let's create a method as get details. And display method displays the details of employee. Now let's create an object of this class. So employee emp1 equals new employee. I think I made a mistake. I should have named the method as set details and not get details. I'll teach you when to set and get prefixes. Now our code is working fine. Also create object of one class inside another class. Ok, let's understand this by an example. Here I have created one main class as team manager. Let's create classes for other team members. So class member 1 and they have only one method called as work done which displays the message. Now another member Now we can create objects of these classes in class team manager.
and the message is printed so that's all i wanted to show you in this video if you have any doubt please do comment guys all my videos are free we are not a team i'm just a one man doing all this work please hit that like button visit code archery and subscribe don't forget to share and thank you so much for watching my videos